Come on to all fours. Release the crown of your head down to the earth, a little bit out in front of your hands. Curl your toes under and lift your knees up off the ground like downward dog. Walk your feet in close to the hands. Root down through the palms and the crown of your head and keeping your legs straight and together, exhale, float the legs up into tripod headstand. From here, cross one ankle into a half lotus position, tucking the outside of the foot deep into the hip crease. Try to bring the other foot into full lotus position and first stretch the knees up towards the sky. Then exhale, begin to slowly lower the knees down towards the triceps. Pull the navel in and really round into a little ball, trying to bring the knees as high up on the triceps as you comfortably can. You're gonna root down through the palms and float the top of your head up off of the ground. Squeeze your legs together so you stay in the lotus position. Move your arms as straight as you comfortably can. Tuck the chin and gently tap the crown back down onto the earth. Shift your weight into the head and hands and float your lotus back up towards the sky. From here, you're gonna release the legs and come into the lotus with the other foot in the hip crease. First, extend the knees towards the sky, stretch it out. And then allowing the back to round a little bit, draw the lotus in towards your belly. Release the knees down onto the triceps, press with the palms, and float the head off of the earth. Arms are like chaturanga, or you can try to straighten the arms to challenge yourself. Chin to chest, lower the crown back down onto the earth. Press with the palms, float your lotus back up, and extend the legs up towards the sky. Keeping your legs straight and strong, lower them together towards the earth. Gently placing your feet onto the ground, coming into child's pose, and resting on the forehead for a few easy breaths.